we can combine our split hand to start to get uh, a little bit of a nice tune. So our right hand is moving at that slow speed. We remember it, it's one, two, three, four, five, six, one, two, three, four, five, six, one, two, three, four, five, six. Our left hand is gonna be moving a little bit faster. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, one, two, three, four, five, six, one, two, three, four, five, six, one, two, three, four, five, six. So together we're gonna to get this kind of effect. One, two, three, four, five, six, one, two, three, four, five, six, one, two, three, four, five, six. Let's try that with the metronome. Four, five, start with the right two. Bring the left hand in. And when we're feeling comfortable with that, we can move the right hand around. Let's move to this note. We might want to try it the other way around. So we're starting with our left hand on the ding. Now flipping the hands around, off we go. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Let's hear the right hand. So that's one, two, three, four, five, one. <laughs> One, two, the sneeze was optional. <laughs> start to move around a little bit and this is a slightly harder exercise we're going to be swapping every time so if on the first try you can't get both of the hands just focus on the ding hand or the moving hand but if you want to put it together we'll start with the left hand on the ding and the right hand down on the note nearest us one two three four five six one two Right. We're 
squat one more time. Left to the ding. One, two, three. So what it means is you end up doing left, so it's like one ding, ding. Left, ding, ding. So right, left, left, right, left, 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 right, right. So on that one that we're switching, we actually end up doing three in a row. Let's try it one more time. Now we've got the hang of it. Starting left in the ding. Off we go. Left, right, right, left, right, right, left, right, right. Swapping hands. Right, left, left, right, left, left, right. Swapping hands. Left, right, right, left, right, right, left, right. Swapping hands. Right, left. one more application we can have for our split hand. So we can use it for a really simple way of adding a backbeat or a piece of percussion. Uh, and that is using a tack or a slap on the side. So we're just going for the interstitial for the bit in between the notes for this sound. Or we can even do it right up here without moving our hand too much, whichever feels easier for now. The din is one, two, three, four, five, six, one, two, Five. Or you might just want to play it right here. Five, six, one, two, three, six, one, two, three, four. Whatever feels best for you. So if we set our right hand to doing that, we can play that pattern we've just played before without swapping hands and we start to get a bit of a tune and accompaniment. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, up we go. Back down. is super duper handy. Let's try that with the other hand. So instead of playing ding, ding with the left hand, ding, ding with the left hand, it's ding, tack with the left hand, ding. And it works the same way. The hand is still coming in this way. We're just not coming all the way back up to the ding. And you can play them here. Have a practice with putting them here. Or you can put them all the way down here just depends what you're doing. And with that click. One, two, three, four. Other hand fills in. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three. And we'll change our note. 